Boys and girls, welcome to a new series we're starting on the channel. Today we have Medal of Honor European Assault. I played this game way back in the day. I didn't get very far into the game because I honestly upgraded to an Xbox 360 and then started playing the Call of Duties instead. So while I have played this game, do I remember anything about it? Nope. Not at all. With that said, if you guys are excited for this series, like and sub down below because I do plan on playing through the entire game along with all the other games I have going on on the channel at the moment. But without wasting more time, let's hop in. When people ask me what I did in the war, I tell them that I did the same thing we all did. We fought for what was right. I've come to realize that there's nothing good about war, but there is good in why you fight wars. And we were all fighting for the same thing. You know, Holt, when I volunteered, I couldn't wait for this moment. Now that it's here... Winslow's been monitoring the radio, sir. Looks like the stolen signals worked. The Jerrys still think we're one of their own. Incoming! Yeah, I'm, I'm good, bro. Will do. Okay. How does this game work? Okay, the buttons are the buttons are definitely early PlayStation game buttons. So, give me a sec. Oh man, this is a uh, insane difference from the game I was just playing right before this, the original COD 2. Oh, there's a guy up there. And my homie on the MG is missing every shot. I'm playing the PS2 emulated version in case anyone cares or is curious as to how we're here. I don't know if there was a different version of the game. If there was, I sincerely apologize because I think playing the other version might have been the better choice. Okay, so what buttons do what? That's that. The music is good though, I'll give him that. you guys enjoy this series and it makes it worth playing not that i wouldn't have fun because if i wasn't having fun i wouldn't be playing but is that guy t-posing yeah that guy's t-posing but uh obviously the content is uh mp40 smg the content is more fun to make if the people that are viewing the videos also you know just enjoy what's going on so 
remember to uh, like and sub down below if you actually enjoy and want to see the rest of the playthrough of these games that I post. This game seems to have quite a few bugs. <laughs> You a friendly? I think so. What up? Are you Captain Beck? Oh, you're a sight for sore eyes. Right. Let's send these bastards back to hell. Sledgehammer, come in. This is Saber, requesting air support and coordinates 32847. Um. No, oh, don't worry, bro. I'll do whatever you need me to do. We'll get there eventually, and we'll get there together. That's all that matters. Out of all the games I have played on my emulator, this is the first game that feels like it's a PlayStation 2 game. And I don't know why that is. I mean that because the first two Medal of Honor games, Frontline and Rising Sun, like, weren't... They didn't feel like this. They felt much better. They called it the greatest raid ever. And the memories I have don't even seem real to me. I was the only American with him. I was an officer with the OSS. For my part, it began in the spring of 1942. Hitler's war machine was steamrolling over Europe, and years of punishing German attacks were finally taking its toll on Britain. Nazi U-boats continually patrolled the North Atlantic, tightening the noose around Britain's neck. Then word reached London that the Germans were sending the battleship Tirpitz. If that happened, the British coast would be vulnerable to attack, and what little defenses they had left would soon crumble. Since all previous attempts to sink the Tirpitz had failed, their target would now be the only dry dock in the area large enough to service her, in German-occupied Saint-Nazaire, France. This was considered by many to be a suicide mission, but for the British, desperate times meant desperate measures, and things had never been more desperate. St. Nazaire is nothing like I thought it would be. We smashed the dock and landed in a firestorm. We have our orders. Take out the fuel tanks. The OSS wants me to keep my eyes and ears open for more intel. They gave me the name of a German officer, Mueller. That's all I've got. Recon says the dock is more heavily fortified than we thought. We need to move quickly if we're going to hold on to our advantage. Whatever happens, men, get to the petrol tanks. Uh Okay, okay. Come on then. So we're guns to the right. Petrol tank straight ahead. For sure, we're right here. We're literally right where we left off, which is about what I assumed. Where did my M1 Garand go? We just had it. Oh, this aim assist is whoa, that was crazy. This aim assist locks on, locks on. I hope some of the people watching this are having nostalgia because like I said, I played this game way, way back in the day, so. This is about as far as I got. I did not get super duper far into this game, so we'll, we will see. Can I go back up here and pick up one of these? Nope, they despawned. All right, I missed my chance, my bad. I want a rifle. Oh, it's one of these games where if you ADS, you stop. Ow. 
Ouch. All right, we're just we're running we're running and gunning. We gotta we gotta figure something out. I'm also basically dead. What's my heal button? Oh, that's my that's that button. Um. Okay, down on D-pad is my is my heal button. I'm gonna see if there's any tinkering I can do on my end after we record this part of the game. Because there's no reason the game should feel this silly. Unless it's actually just this silly. And if it is, then whatever, I'll deal with it, but... I gotta remember what buttons do what, because I have died <laughs> technically twice now, because I just I'm not healing because I forget what the button is. I gotta just remember what it is. But everything I've said I don't know how long this game actually is. I guess we'll find out together. Or even, actually, no, people watching this probably already know how long the game is. I don't, so. You guys will know and you can laugh at me as I try to ponder how long this game actually is. Okay, I need. I need that. I really need you to get out of the way, brother. Let's pick up ammo, let's figure out life. Still trying to figure out the actual game, too. Oh, that's one of our guys. Um, do we talk to you? Okay, I got you, bro. Don't worry. I'm I'm the best at listening and going to objective markers that are on my screen. Um, what are we looking for? This. Okay. Well, I mean, am I even going to get away? This is a long ways to run for a time charge. Oh, that looks fantastic. Yeah, that is... That is definitely 2005 PS2 technology. Trying to do way too much. Way. 
Leaving by rail. Oh, this is a map. Um. I don't think this is what I wanted. All right, we're back. Um, I don't like this. We're just gonna go. We're gonna go and we're gonna fire from the hip. Okay, there's the train. Okay, there's everybody they warned us about. Valid. This part of the game is very loud. I guess not this part of the game. This game is just very loud. Alright, we're not allowed to hit that guy. Whatever, that's fine. Let's just leave. Let's just leave. If it's an option, let's just get out of here. Thank you, thank you. Is this a glitch, or are you guys all supposed to be the exact same character? 